Hey, this is Tom at Berno, and we're going to talk about downrigger mounting today. Downriggers are great when you need them, but if you're like me, I didn't want to screw bases permanently to my boat because when you're not using the downrigger, they're kind of in the way and they don't look so great. So that's a real common reason for people to get into the Berno and mounting system is specifically for using downriggers. This is a Canon over here. We've also got a Scotty today. We're going to walk you through the details of how this system works. Pretty straightforward, but we do get some questions about it. Essentially, all of the downriggers mount using our UM6080 base. This has a four hole pattern that happens to match one of the mounting options for cannons. Everything else will make use of one of our adapter plates. We make an adapter plate for Scotties, cannons, pens, and big johns. We don't have a pen or big john downrigger here today, so we're just gonna kinda show you how it works and then go into detail on these two downriggers. The UM6080 ships with four fasteners and these four fasteners are what you'll use to attach the adapter plate to the UM6080 base. You'll use your downrigger mount fasteners to mount to the adapter plate. The only tool you really need to do this job is a Phillips screwdriver. This is a number two. We also always recommend that you use a marine grade anti-seize. We like to use a product called Slick On. It's a marine specific anti-seize, which just means that it doesn't have metallic compounds in the compound itself. All right, here we have the Scotty and the Canon downriggers. And right now I've got these both set up how I run them, which is without a swivel base. So I do not have a swivel base on either one of these downriggers. So what that means for fishing is that once a day or however many times you're deploying your downriggers, you need to just release our release, lift the downrigger to clear the spline and turn it out to wherever you want it and drop it back in. Same with the Scotty. In a way, the Scotty's a little easier to do that with because all their electric downriggers mount on their tilt-up base. So you can grab a hold of the boom, do the same thing and turn it where you want it for the day. The difference between the two is that if you're doing that type of setup with the cannon, you don't need any adapter plates at all. So what that looks like is this. This is the UM6080 and cannons, what we refer to as their dovetail base, which is what's on here right now, bolts directly to the UM6080 with the four fasteners that came with the UM6080. So once you screw this in, you just slide the downrigger in here and fasten it on. And I'll take a, um, this downrigger out and just show you that a little closer. You can see here, that's a really simple, clean setup. In Scotty's case, even without the swivel base, you need to use the adapter plate. That's because their downriggers all mount on their flip-up base. So to mount a downrigger with Scotty, you've got to use our adapter plate and either their tilt-up base or their swivel base. We'll show you that in a minute. The one downside of running the downriggers like this that some people don't like is that they then have to lift it a little bit, clear the spline, and they feel like on the water, that might be a little bit dangerous. So if you want to use a swivel base, let's switch back to Canon, you would put the Canon adapter plate on. Remember, without the swivel base, you don't need it. Canon adapter plate goes here on the UM6080, the dovetail base goes on their swivel. It's a pretty compact setup. In Scotty's case, you would put the Scotty adapter plate on the UM6080 and the swivel base on the adapter plate with Scotty's factory setup. So really, all of the downriggers mount the same way with the exception of the Canon, which you can skip the adapter plate if you don't want to use the swivel base. Okay, that's a basic overview of downrigger mounting with the Berno and mount system. So remember though that uh, the Bernoin mount is really a nice looking piece and it's a much smaller footprint than a downrigger base. And the real advantage is that once you have that mount on your boat, you can use that particular spot for a number of other applications. We make rod holders, fillet tables, cutting boards, fender cleats, flag holders, barbecue mounts, all of which you can check out at Bernoin.com.